My personal definition of masculinity, I believe, is best described in keywords rather than sentences or paragraphs. These are those keywords. Strength, goal setting, accomplishment, personal empowerment, self-improvement, personal growth, healing, regeneration, rebirth, power, resilience, resistance, and fortitude. I believe that a man's purpose in life, his overall aim, should always be himself. He should not allow others to define this goal for him, as in most cases, all they seek to do is manipulate and control him for their own purposes and to accomplish their own goals. A parasite cannot produce its own food, so it has to feed off of the host without offering anything in return. This is manipulation, coercion, control, and greed. It leads to nothing but empowerment, survival, and strength for the parasite whilst depriving the host of more and more every feeding session. Many people in a man's life do this to him. His wife, his girlfriend, his friends, his foes, his children. Some are worth the sacrifice as they are actually offering something in return. Your children might be able to, able to keep your genetic lineage going. Your wife might sexually please you and do work around the house. Your parents might raise you, pass down their wisdom and their strengths. However, the key difference between a parasite and a symbiote is that one offers something in return, whereas the other just takes and takes and takes. What is important is to be able to recognize and have the will to determine to what happens to those who try to manipulate you, who try to control you, to coerce you, to break you down or build you up for their own purposes. Who are you willing to cut off? Who are you willing to support? And why? What do they offer in exchange for this sacrifice? You must answer this question as truthfully and objectively as possible in order to make the judgment as to whether they are a parasite or a symbiote.